guys and welcome back to my channel and welcome to another PJ Maxx or Marshalls vlog. We are now going to be hitting Marshalls this week. We decided to switch it up a little bit. We saw TJ Maxx last week. We want to see what's happening with Marshalls here now. And of course, my beautiful co-stars. We got my mom over here and my niece Amaya. She's a little distracted right now. She's very excited to go in. I mean, she's just okay. looking right at the store. Okay. So let's go ahead and go inside of Marshalls and see what kind of beauty deals we can find today. Mm. And here we go. I'm actually very excited about this because it has been actually two years since I've stepped foot inside of a Marshalls. So I'm excited to see what kind of deals we're looking at here now. And I know this isn't beauty, but I just had to show you guys this. I saw it as I was walking in and it's an entire display of Gucci shoes. Like when did Marshalls start getting Gucci? This is crazy. Like this pair of heels here, so cute. They were $4.29. These flats in the back, $3.59. I mean, adorable. If I had a spare 400 bucks, I would have probably gotten those heels there. <laughs> and then these tennis shoes here, they were actually also 429. The ones right next to it, again, also 429. So, I mean, I guess compared to regular priced Gucci, it's a little bit of a deal. I actually don't really know what regular priced Gucci is, <laughs> but very cool to see. All right, but let's head over now to what we really came here for, the beauty. And right away, I can't help but notice this pure five-piece brush set. It looks like it has a couple face and eye brushes in it. We got the powder, blush, eyeshadow base, crease, and blending brush, all for just $12.99 in this. And right next to that, we had a little bit of a Becca Foundation jackpot here. This was the Ultimate Coverage 24-Hour Foundation. She was $10.99, and we had the shades Desert, Sand, and Porcelain. Even behind it, another foundation. I thought it was going to be the same one as the first one, but it's not. This one is the Ultimate Coverage Complexion Cream. It's $10.99 in the shade Amber. And then we had right along with it another one of the ultimate coverages, but this is the long wear concealer in the shade cream for $6.99. And the Becca continues. Now we got the Perfect Skin Mineral Powder Foundation. This is the shade Tobacco for $12.99. And right next to it, there was the Shadow and Light Brow Contour in Cocoa for $4.99. And then I just had to show this one. This is the Chloe and Malika collab that they had with Becca. The BFF's Glow Letters for $6.99. Just wanted to show it off because I saw it at TJ Maxx. I just want to show that it's also here at Marshalls. And now back to a little bit more pure here. This is the Translucent Loose Setting Powder. She's here for $6.99. And some Stila right next to it. It's the Tinted Moisturizer Skin Balm for $9.99. I found the shade 1.0. 4.0 and 2.0 quite a few of those here there is so much bh popping up nowadays it's crazy tj maxx and marshall's has a ton of it so i found two of these blush palettes the mrs bella this is the rosy one i couldn't find a price anywhere on the packaging of it but i'm assuming it's going to be the same as this peachy version which was $4.99 and then we have the matching set for the eyeshadow of the Mrs. Bella collection. She was also $4.99, and you got all those shades in there. Then we had the Sweet Shop Pistachio Palette. Again, no price tag anywhere on there. Super annoying, and I just had to assume it's been messed with, and yep. Oh, so frustrating when that happens. It looked like such a beautiful palette, but uh, looks like someone smashed it, either dropped it or something. And then there was the 90s Remix Dance Palette. Again, it was missing its outer carton, so no price tag. I just kind of wanted to check to see if it was smashed as well. But nope, she was actually fully intact. It looked like it may have been swatched by someone, so I was a little skeptical about it, but it looked like a very pretty little palette. And lastly, for the BH Palette Finds, there was the Amethyst February Palette for $5.99. This one didn't have anything holding it together, so I always feel a little little bit skeptical about these ones in the store because you never know if someone's dipped their finger into it but it did look like a very pretty little palette and then from the corner of my eye I spot the glam light cake palette like what this one looks like it's a mini oven and the color scheme on the back oh my gosh for $14.99 
This palette looked incredible. I almost purchased this one. I am trying not to purchase anything though until I do a declutter, but I was so close to breaking that rule for this one. Another brand I love to find products of is the Milk Beauty line. You can find quite a few now popping up. This was the Supernova Stick Highlighter. She was just $5.99, honestly very affordable. Unfortunately, all were Supernova shades, but they had quite a few, so pretty cool. And another one that is popping up a whole lot more now is Morphe here. We have three of their big palettes here. This is the 35T, the Dope Taupe. We had the 35P, the Plum Pleaser. All of these are going to be $19.99, by the way. And the 35R, the Ready Set Gold Palette. I would honestly love to see some of their brushes next popping up at Marshalls or TJ Maxx. I'm crossing my fingers. I was not ready for this. Dragon Beauty, Nikita's own line, is now at Marshalls. This was the Fantasy Palette Volume 2 for $6.99 here. I think that was such an affordable price. I really, really wanted to grab this one. I had a hold back so bad. <laughs> but I saw it was open, so I just kind of want to look inside, see if it was smashed, but it looked like she was intact. Oh my gosh, it took all of my strength not to pick up this one in the Glam Light palette. Can you find a toy? Oh. Oh. Wait, we're getting the toy. We're totally getting that toy. Oh. She is just too dang cute. She melts my heart. But anyways, back to the makeup. So it looks like we got a little wet and wild here. This is the mini mascara collection for $4.99. And I'm assuming this was probably a part of some sort of Christmas collection just based on the packaging here. Another product line I love to spot while I'm here is the Stila line, and I found quite a few this time. So first up, we had the eyeliner brush for $5.99. That was a nice little find there. We had a glitter and glow, also a shimmer and glow. The first one was the Rock and Rose shade, and the other one, oh, I hope I say this right, Pigelli? <laughs> Both of those are going to be $5.99. Such a good deal for those liquid shadows. So good. And then we had two of the Beauty Boss lip glosses. There was the shade Kitten and Win Win. Both of these were also for $5.99. So really great prices on those. And then lastly of the Stila, there was this duo set here for $5.99. This one was a slightly smaller version than those other two liquid shadows I just showed. But it was the Double Dip Suede Shade and Glitter and Glow in Glow Dust. Oh, not Glow Dust. <laughs> Gold Dust. Then I found two mascaras I wanted to show off to you guys. The BH Cosmetics Stellar Lash Volumizing Mascara. This one seemed like a good deal at $4.99. But the Marc Jacobs at Lashed. This one, I feel like it should be a pass. It was $12.99 for this mini size, and I feel like I've seen the full size here before, kind of around the same price, so try to avoid that one if you can. Because just as a comparison here out of these lipsticks I'm about to show you, the first is the Marc Jacobs Lamarck Liquid Lip Crayon. This one was $5.99, and it was a full size, so you can kind of see how the other one is a little bit of a rip off there <laughs> for that mini size but continuing along with the lips products that I got here we had the Bobbi Brown crushed lip color this was the shade cranberry for $9.99 and then we had the bite beauty a yay slayer the plumping lip gloss in the shade plum tart she was $5.99 and then we have the MAC Healthy, Wealthy, and Thriving Powder Kiss Lipstick for $7.99 and then a brand I would never have guessed I would have found at Marshall's, Fenty Beauty. This was the Kilowatt Foil Highlighter in the shade Mimosa Sunrise and Sangria Sunset for $7.99. And then even more Dragon Beauty. Like, Marshall's was a gold mine this time around. So we have the Dragon Glass Matte Liquid Lipstick and the Dragon Glass Gloss in the shade Jinx and Dragon Blood, each for just $4.99. Such good deals. So many new brands I'm seeing here, and it is so freaking exciting. Now, I mean, now I've seen the lip products and the eyeshadow palette here by Nikita. I ended up finding one more of the Milk Makeup products. This was the Kush Triple Brow Pen for $6.99, and it was the shade Haze. 
Now let's move over to some brushes. And the first one I find is the BH Face Essentials. This is a seven piece brush set for $9.99. We got the jumbo face, angled contour, rounded face, flat powder, angled brush, rounded cheek, rounded highlight. So many brushes in there. And then another BH set. This was the Flower Power five piece set. It had eye and face brushes for $7.99. We got the blush brush, the Lux blend, shader, blending, and detail buffer. I feel like if you try to say brush names fast, it sounds like a tongue twister because, oh my god, I was struggling there. <laughs> These next ones are actually some of my mom's favorite brushes. These are the Japanese brushes. I found six different ones. This one here was the Luxe Powder for $6.99. We also had the Angled Blush Brush for $5.99. The Buff and Blend for $5.99. The All Over Eyeshadow for $3.99. The Precision Baking for $3.99, and lastly, the Domed Powder Small for $4.99. And then a really fun brush I found was the Pure Skin Perfecting Foundation Brush. This one honestly reminded me a lot of that Artiste one, the super fluffy brush looking one for just $9.99, so a cool little dupe. And then we had the Real Techniques Electric Love Trio of Sponges for $5.99. You got a complexion blender, a finishing blender, and a perfecting blender. I don't know about you guys, but I usually just use one <laughs> blender for everything, but a cool little trio there. I just about lost it here on this next section. You guys know I love me some press-on nails. That is exclusively what I've been wearing for the past couple of years. They are so good. You can do your nails whenever you want, get some really great styles for really cheap. I am obsessed with them. These were all $4.99, by the way. I went through and checked every one of them. And such a good deal for these Kiss Nails. I really enjoy them. So many styles. I've never seen this many at one store before. I've only ever found like one at a time. And we have the Kiss brand and also the Kala brand here. I've tried them before too. This exact pair I have worn. They are fabulous. Also $4.99. And then these bottom ones I have not tried before. They are called Tip Beauty. Again, $4.99. And they had some really beautiful styles and... Yeah, I'm obsessed. If you have not tried Press On Nails, you need to try it ASAP because who doesn't love just being able to pop on whatever design you want and then being able to have backups if you break one? I mean, seriously, $4.99, a steal. So yeah, I freaked out a little bit in this section. <laughs> But now moving over to the hair care section and I found a ton of these shampoo and scalp brushes for $5.99. I've actually been looking for one because they say this is supposed to be really good for stimulating hair growth. So you, just so you know, you can find some there. And then Living Proof on Deck here. There was this duo of the PHD Dry Shampoo it was a $52 value with a $35 price tag, but at Marshall's, she was $24.99. We then had the PHD Conditioner. This is the giant bottle. It was $29.99. Right next to it, we had a medium size of that same one for $14.99. Then we had this purple bottle, the Restore Conditioner. It's a medium size for $14.99. Next to it... The mini version of the Restore Conditioner for $4.99. We had a mini full conditioner, $4.99. A mini frizz conditioner, $4.99. And lastly of the minis, the mini PHD for $5.99. And then the very last product was a single version of the PHD dry shampoo for $16.99. All right, you guys, we just walked outside of Marshall's holy moly there was some amazing stuff this time i had no idea that dragon beauty and fenty beauty are now at marshall's that was extremely exciting to see <laughs> amaya got herself a, an amazing little toy too she found a deal here yeah you found a deal <laughs> yeah so she walked out a winner here but yeah, it's so exciting to see that inside of Marshalls. Uh, we might continue switching it up each time. I don't know. Let me know what you guys thought comparing TJ Maxx to Marshalls. But yeah, I really hope that you guys liked today's video. And my co-stars co here. Co-stars. <laughs> uh, yeah, if you liked today's video, don't forget to ah, hit the like button. 
subscribe to my channel and hit that little bell button <laughs> and we'll see you guys in the next video bye guys so talkative you are